My students, please take a seat. Today's lesson will be about light. This fruit honestly hurts my eyes. It's literally a Discord light mode fruit. I'm giving this one a D tier on the fruit value list. A businessman needs his valuable fruits. You guys got it wrong. This fruit is really good, honestly. Light for PvP is quite good, having high combo potential, long range, and great damage. Its flight is also very powerful in PvP as well, being fast, enough to easily escape bounty hunters or go after them. But one of the best attributes of light for PvP is that it's very fast, making it a little hard to predict and more easier to land hits. While not as good as Buddha or Magma in the late game, from 1st to 2nd C it's very good. This fruit is the king of beginner grinding fruits. Its speed makes island travel fast. Its in one makes it easy to dispatch enemies early game because later on the number of NPCs with Haki increases. Overall, if you're a new player this fruit needs to be your priority. 650,000 belly for a fruit that is great at PvP, grinding and traveling. How can I say this is not worth the price? For damage light gets in a tier, its damage is very high and is some of the highest among the awakened fruits. For PvP it also gets in a tier, it's great for PvP do its combo. Potential, fast attacks, fast flight to engage enemies or run away and it's high damage. For PV it gets an S tier, great for beginners. The number one fruit for first C grinding, and even in the late game, it's still good ADP. For price, it gets an S. You literally can't go wrong with this fruit. It has little downsides and is good at any level. Also, 650k for a fruit with grades like these would get an S, no doubt. Light's total score is an S from being great at PV to being great at PVP and even traveling this fruit offers everything you need to do anything in the game without having to switch it until next time students class is dismissed